18-year-old Joshua Sulio Jr. was a resident of Jigo and a student at Simon Sanchez High School. He's a, he's a hardworking boy, uh, loves to help the family, you know, uh, does his best at everything, loves the outdoors, skateboarding, offloading, uh, even just going into the jungle. His father, Joshua Sulio Sr., is still coming to terms with what happened his son's life taken away by a driver who fled the scene. At first, uh, I was angry uh, because, you know, the time, especially the time that it happened, I was walking up, didn't know what to expect. Uh, I was told he was in an accident and uh, he's in route to the hospital. So I went down and uh, now when I saw him, I, I, I didn't know what to do. It was around 1 o'clock early Sunday morning, drivers who passed by spotted Sulio lying on the side of the road and called 911. The incident occurred along Mayat Lazama Road in Jigo, just 500 feet from the gate to Anderson Air Force Base. Medics arrived and rushed him to the Guam Memorial Hospital, where he was pronounced dead at 4.30 a.m. Fighting back tears, his father had this message to his son. Son, I know you are, you are going through a lot. I know I was hard on you, but I was only doing it to set you on your right path and that I love you from the bottom of my heart. As for a message to the community, Mr. Sulio urges the public to come forward if they have any information about the incident or the driver who fled the scene. For this uh, tragic, tragic accident uh, that happened to my son, it was sad. Uh, really uh, unexpected and you know if anybody can help identify the vehicle I just need an answer you know any answer if you can help him find closure to his son's death please call GPD's Highway Patrol Division at 475-8463 or Guam Crime Stoppers at 477-HELP Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Nick Delgado.